Hello and welcome to number 28, Aka Villa on the La Hinch Road in Ennis County Clare. Presented for sale in excellent condition throughout is this fantastic three bedroom semi detached family home boasting an incredible finish both inside and out. As you can see here to the front, the owner has very nicely landscaped along the border of the Tarmac Adam Drive with gated side access that leads to a stunning rare decking and patio and indeed rare shrubbery and so on and you'll see so much of that as the video continues. But without delay, let's take a look at the inside of number 28, Aka Villa. So on entering the main entrance hallway, you can really see what I meant outside when I say, said outstanding finishes. It is so clear the minute you set foot inside the door of this house, the exquisite finishes that await the prospective buyer. The really tasteful finish that you'll see expressed throughout this home is an absolute credit to the current owners. If you're not familiar with where Aka Villa is, it's just on the Lahinch Road, just opposite Donnellan's Centra. Uh, as you head out, the Lahinch Road is on the right hand side. Uh, easy proximity to all of the amenities of Ennis Town and indeed access onto the Inner Relief Road. But for those into the outdoors, you have the Hinch, the Burren National Park and so much more within 25 minutes. So back into the house here and to start showing off some of the highlights, we have, as I said, as I said the entrance hallway as you come in, that has the L-shaped carpeted painted and rail stairs uh, and polished rail stairs, I should say, leading to the first floor landing. That incorporates ample understairs storage, but I've left all the doors open just for you to see the continuation of and the flow of that tiling. So smartly done, a really good way of decorating uh, your, your, your floor finishes is to have the same floor running right through and the owner certainly has it done here. But the main entrance uh, hall, very, very spacious. As I turn the camera around, you can see the distance now between the stairs and the front door. So plenty of space for, as you can see, the owner has it already done here with the coat or the hanging rail. You can put in a built-in bench there for your shoes or whatever it needs to be. But then you're into a, a, an equally fabulous uh, main reception room finished with the solid timber flooring. The Just the whole attention to detail is really, really top class. The French doors are, are leading out onto the open plan or into the open plan kitchen dining. The raised electric fire unit here on the right hand side, just a nice feature. The quality of your wall decor. You have the um, smart homes set up here as well. So you'll see the different panels. You'll see panels in each of the rooms and the ceiling mounted speaker units. A really good system I've had it on here uh, and very, very nice system indeed. Then into the open plan kitchen dining. And as you arrive into the kitchen, you immediately see the quality of the, of, of the built-in wall and base units. It's a solid shaker oak uh, kitchen with ample work surfaces. You have eye level uh, shelving. You have the integrated fan assisted oven and four ring gas hob, the single drainer sink, the tile splashback, uh, the under counter lighting. That flows out into the utility and then further connects into the ground floor WC, but you have a very nice open plan set up here into the formal dining space. The breakfast counter here that has been extended to facilitate uh, additional seating and uh, of course additional base storage as well. You can see the space here for the dresser doors, connecting doors back into that main reception room, the tiling, the quality of your wall decor, and then the French doors out into what can only be described as an absolute wow rare garden. Um, we've had plenty of showers, um, a fantastic July for Ireland, but we have plenty of showers. So in case it rains again, I'm going to do a very quick glance out into the rare gardens. You can see the raised decking, the hidden space here, finished in sleepers for your for your bins. You have the raised beds, but take note of the of the of the recessed lighting in the walls, the quality, and then the step down into the non-slip tile patio, the open fire uh, at, the, at the end of it there, and that has the chimney popping up over the back of it there, um, but just an overall fantastic space. Uh, but again, take note of just the finishes, the way the sleepers have been cut, the way the shrubbery has been integrated, the caps on the walls with the brick, and the continuation of the decking on part of the caps there beside the fireplace, and then you have your built-in barbecue unit here, uh, a little bit of an unfinished project, um, but almost finished. Um, the vendor would probably give out to me for saying that, but anyway, um, it's probably the only thing to give out about in this house. 
um, but um, he was hoping to put in integrated shelving units and a bit of storage and so on but you can see the space that you have there um, but look at the for a housing development house the outstanding landscaping and you can see the great privacy you have sitting in your barbecue area at the back and as I say that vast decking is really really stunning so back in safe from any possible rain we pop up the stairs and show off the three bedrooms and main bathroom so arriving on the first floor landing you have the quality carpet flooring continued right through here to the landing space to the front of the house you have two bedrooms uh, one straight ahead of us there another one here to the right the hot press here to the right hand side another bedroom here to the rear and your main bathroom here behind me off the landing space as well you have a very nice velux window um, which gives great natural light popping straight in here into the into the landing space you have the styro stairs that gives you access to the additional attic storage but here again nothing standard about this house everything has been just upgraded and upgraded to a very very high end here in the main bathroom you have your tile panel bath with the separate shower uh, shower overhead but just look at again just taking note of the finishes the nice of the, the, the taps everything has been done to such a high specification the integrated washroom basin with the additional base storage the overhead mirrored storage cabinet the low level wc and the quality of your ceiling to floor tiling is really a wow then into the first of your bedrooms going in an anti-clockwise direction here but you have your semi-solid timber flooring you have the built-in wardrobes here no shortage of shelving hanging rails and actually give you a, a, a peek at them because they're so well done you know you have your hanging rails inside you have your integrated drawers shelving and the continuation even of the timber floors just overall so well thought out and then another glimpse at that rear garden from above a very very nice outdoor space to be enjoying then as we pop back into the landing we head into the master bedroom and again very nicely appointed room with the continuation of that semi-solid oak flooring and then you have the built-in wardrobes once again like what you saw in the last room finished with shelving hanging rails overhead and base storage everything done to a t and then of course off of here then we have the ensuite and the ensuite would you expect anything else but top class and here it is again ceiling to floor tiling this quality of your sanitary wear the overhead uh, mirror unit and that lighting unit as well lighting unit is I'll just turn it on so that you can have a look at it but again all so so well done behind that then is the shower and the shower with the overhead pump shower and of course your glass panel shower door and that back back in then into your bedroom and then finally rounding off the accommodation and rounding off the property as a whole we have the smallest room in the house but the great thing about the Acavilla houses is that they're pretty much it can all be deemed as double rooms no shortage of space in here and the ceiling mount is spotlighting unit again if i haven't said it in some of the other bedrooms and i don't think i have but just take note of all the speakers that you see in the ceilings they all have their own uh, smart home panel which is this here okay so to give you some bit of an idea i have it actually switched off below so but you have the if you switch it on there's a box underneath the stairs you switch that on that gives acts that gives makes every panel live um, but a great sound system i had it on during our measurements uh, just to make sure um, that i knew how to operate it and it is top class so that rounds off our fantastic home here at Aka Villa under the Hinch Road in Ennis. Please do feel free to call us to arrange a viewing on 065 684 or email us info at dngosullivanhurley.com. Thank you very much for watching and hopefully we will be showing you around this really super three bedroom home in the very near future. Thank you very much.